VNR VJIET is one of the premier institutes in the state of Telangana where many students aspire to join. Electronics and Communication Engineering is the most sought after stream by the students. The Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering was established in 1995. With a blend of experienced and youthful staff, the department offers a wider range of skills to the students. With an intake of 60, it has grown by leaps and bounds and today it caters to the intellectual appetite of 240 UG students and 2 PG courses in VLSI and embedded systems. The department in line with the ideology to foster research oriented learning hosts a research center recognized by JNTUH. The department is headed by Dr. Y Padmasai, a visionary leader, steering the department towards winning more accolades and in shaping bright career for its students. Dr. Y Padmasai has essayed various leadership roles like Dean Student Progression, IST State Secretary, Chair Women in Engineering IEEE. She is also the recipient of Best Engineering Teacher Award from IST and Innovation Awards. Being the principal investigator for various R&D projects, She has a keen eye on innovation in the form of patents. Principal Dr. C. D. Naidu, recipient of the Best Engineering College Principal Award from IST, was also a former HOD EC. The strength of the department are the faculty with 12 doctorates, 37 faculty pursuing their PhD. They have a varied domain expertise, catering to the needs of the industry by making their students competent enough with the leading edge technologies. Our ICT-enabled classrooms creates an ambient atmosphere conducive for learning. The lab Laboratories are well equipped in inculcating research culture among the students besides meeting the stipulated academic requirements. Blended learning happens through VNR differentiators like Wit and Will, Poggle, Lab Protocol, Storyboard, Flipped Classroom, etc. in catering to the students with various perceptions of learning. Project-based learning is encouraged through course-based projects, mini-projects, internships and societal impact projects which cultivate interpersonal skills required to work as a team. Right from their second year, the students are exposed to various competitions to prove their mettle. Self-esteem and leadership qualities are nurtured by motivating them to participate in various hackathons, project expos like open house where they learn to handle themselves confidently, participating in competitions, team challenges, volunteering activities through professional societies which build leadership qualities and enhance their chances in career growth. The outcome is evident. When EC students emerge winners in Smart India Hackathon organized by MHRD and AICT at national level, Swish Hackathon organized by Swish Foundation, Deloitte Techno Itself organized by Deloitte, JP Morgan Contest Code, Project Contest organized by Bits Hyderabad. MOUs with leading core companies have helped our students in obtaining internship opportunities, placement offers, partial content delivery through the guest lectures and an establishment of advanced labs our efforts have been to nurture positive and creative thoughts among students through a healthy mindset proactive synergy is created among the students through various events held by the department like conferences guest lectures rallies etc hello everyone i am ankita gudla fine year ec student of vnr vjiit i am always thankful to vnr vjiit and EC department for all the support I've got. I was given constant encouragement to be a part of the IEEE student branch and volunteer for it. Being a part of IEEE since my very first year of BTEC helped me improve myself both at a personal and as well as a professional level. Taking part in various events have given me an exposure greater than any other regular student. I would like to thank head of the department Padma Sai ma'am for always having her faith in me and providing me with opportunities and encouraged me to push my boundaries to give my best. I was one among the 16 students across the world selected as Richard E. Marvin scholar and received a $1000 scholarship from IEEE Computer Society. I thank all the faculty for all the support they have shown. I am proud to be placed in Deloitte USI as business technology analyst and I am thankful for all the training sessions and time given by the department and time care taken by the faculty. Last but not least, I am glad to be a student of VNR BJIT and part of EC's department for shaping me in such a way that I am today. I wish all the best for all the juniors. Thank you. With a strong mentoring, training and placement cell in place, 
EC students have garnered attention with highest pay packages like 42.4 lakhs per annum and 96% placements with an average pay package of around 5 lakhs per annum. Hello, I'm Ritesh Bharatwaj, an electronics and communication engineer from VNR VJIT. I'm here to share my experiences on being offered by Denso Corporation, which is a global automotive components manufacturer. So one day I got a mail from our TNP team regarding the Swiss hackathon conducted by Denso team. I was very much interested in attending hackathons and so I participated in it. So I cleared the online test, stood second in the hackathon and cleared the coding draw. Then I got interviewed by the Denso team and finally got selected with an offer of uh, 40 lakhs package per annum. The entire process took around 5 months. During this time, my college supported me in all the ways. They trained me very well to be ready for the interview process. I tried to learn things by doing projects, attending hackathons and meets. They helped me a lot in selection process. It was really a good experience and I really thank my family, friends and college who supported me to achieve this. To all those who are re getting ready for the placements, I have something important to tell you. My dear friend, never let yourself down when you got stuck. Faculty is there for us to support. Use every resource effectively and if you feel there are no resources at all, then create one. Learn from failures and make sure that won't happen again. Set a goal and aim for it. These are the things I learned and uh, it helped me a lot. I'm proud to be an EC student from Vienna. Thank you. Some of our EC students have completed their higher studies in premier institutes like IITs, Ivy League universities abroad and IIMs. This year too, we had a top gate ranker, Ranjit, who secured All India 71st rank. EC students have consistently won Ideal Student and Excellence Awards from IST Professional Society across engineering colleges of AP and Telangana. From across all the branches, EC students have been recipients of TCS Academic Excellence Award for consecutive years. Research resonates well with the EC department as it has got R&D funding for 29 projects from various government funding agencies like AICTE, DST, ITRA, DRDO and AP Corps for a whooping amount of Rs 322.26 lakhs. Research publications of 252 journals from the faculty speaks volumes about the kind of research culture that is imbibed by the staff which is trickled down to the students too for being part of these projects. Two patents have been published and four patents are filed by the EC staff. Startups by students, entrepreneurs among students, all these are byproducts of the research culture existing in the department. Usage of electronics and communication engineering is ubiquitous. It spreads across various fields and it is the core fueling the revolution of digital technologies. After graduation, the EC engineers harness their expertise in managing large scale research and design, development and testing of electronic equipments. These are then used in latest communication devices and other handy technological equipment such as smartphones tablets, wearables, including your smart watches, smart LED TVs, etc. This has led to a surge in the demand for EC engineers. With the background of EC, there is almost anything that you can try, from VLSI to robotics, nanotechnology to optical communication, embedded systems to digital electronics, your options are immense. The job profile in EC throws in a chance to work in the field of circuit design, wireless communication, robotics, embedded systems, VLSI nanotechnology, signal processing, control systems, analog electronics, networking and so on. EC is also been fueling upcoming applications such as self-driving cars and the technologies such as development of next generation sensors for these, artificial intelligence, the internet of things, quantum computing and so on. So I think you should not miss the career in the field of EC. The requirements for which is going to be there for coming decades. All the best and thank you. REC alumni base 
spread across various domains and in various countries holding prominent positions in premier organizations have always been of immense support in mentoring our students and sharing their experiences in the form of guest lectures hi i am sanjana vimulapalli and i am one of the proud alumni of the department of electronics and communication engineering at vnrv jiet i currently work as a system on chip design engineer at intel corporation To start with, the EC department at VNR offers a very practical coursework and associates it with laboratory experiments that expose students to real industry situations. The experienced faculty make learning process a breeze with their unique teaching methods. Not only does the department strive to achieve strong technical standards but also focuses on improving the personal strengths of the students. The faculty encourage participation in various team activities and other curricular forums. The department and the college leave no stone unturned in rewarding students in ways that turn into memories. As I speak now, I'm reminded of the wonderful opportunity that I got in my final year to hoist the national flag on the Republic Day for being the best girl student among students of all branches. This surely is a memory that I would cherish forever. The EC department also maintains a productive relationship with industry which benefits the students by providing them with an exclusive access to leading companies. It also assists the alumni to kick off a successful career. The guidance that I received from my professors in choosing my electives coupled with their exquisite teaching methods helped me discover my passion for logic design and put me where I am today. In a nutshell, I will always be indebted to the resources and faculty of the EC department for helping me pave my career path and I can proudly say with no hesitation that this department strives to achieve the best. Thank you. Hi, I am Vibho and alum of VNR. I graduated in the year 2014 in electronics and communication engineering post which I worked for about 3 years in analytics. I then did my MBA in information management and I'm currently working with Deloitte in the technology strategy space. It is very true that roots need to be strong for a fruitful tree and I believe that my roots stand in that DNA. Thanks to the management for providing all the required facilities, the right ambience and the esteemed faculty who made sure we are molded in academics not just through the regular classroom sessions but also through live projects and industry exposure. I still remember one of our visits to a national remote sensing agency which was responsible for data acquisition and analytics through satellites. This gave us a detailed understanding of satellite communication and was one of the reasons to develop my interest in data and analytics. Apart from the regular industry visits, we also got opportunities to participate in student chapters that are aligned to our courses like the IEEE. This involved activities like conferences, technology meets which enabled us to enhance our capabilities that were beyond the norm. So to sum up the 4 years at VNR it was fun a great learning experience and a lot of memories EC students have always been in the forefront to showcase their innate talent in various technical and cultural fests thereby winning prizes too are encouraged to pursue their passions through various student clubs like literature music dance theater photography telugu literature art etc sports facilities with state of art courts sport fest training equipments help students in following their dreams with fervor EC students are proactive in NSS activities imbibing the spirit of service to community through various ideas they also participate enthusiastically in protecting their environment through various green initiatives taken up in the college